Look at this. I found a shrinking potion. No, no, no. I didn't really find it. I made it myself, of course. But still, it looks very awesome. Let's see how I did it. Roll the intro. Well, I am using falling sand, as you probably guessed. But it's not as easy as it looks. You see, when you stand in falling sand, your eyes are still about half a block above the falling sand. So, I'll put a half slap underneath it. And to make the sand fly, we'll use this command and a really fast clock. You can replace this with the block ID you want, and this with the data value you want. And these are the coordinates you can change. Okay, so we have our shrinking device system thingy now, though there's still a problem. It's spawning sand every single tick. So this is just one block, so this still works fine, but when you want to fill an entire hallway with it, you're gonna have a lot of lag. And every now and then, you'll see that the sand just falls down all of a sudden. To fix that, we'll make the delay of the timer a bit longer. But now the sand disappears immediately. Ugh, so many problems. We'll just set the time to 1, and now it just stays there. We'll put some cobweb here, so the sand still sort of keeps flying. Also, this cobweb makes sure you slowly sink into the floor. But we're not done yet. You can clearly see the cobweb. So what we'll do, we'll put boats over here. For some reason, sand moves up after a while when you do that. Though the heights of the blocks aren't really the way we want them now. So we'll go into MC Edit, use my freeze mobs filter, open the world in 1.7, close the world again, and open it in 1.6 using the NBT Edit mod. And now we'll adjust the position of the boat a bit. Now when we go back into 1.7, you'll see the sand has the correct height. Okay, so let's just build some blocks around it and clone this in MC Edit. Now we'll build the same thing, but without the shrinking part. And we'll make a new clock. This removes the haste potion effect and detects that. To give a haste potion to someone, use this command. Once it's removed, it will teleport you relatively and give you speed potions. This causes your field of view to increase. And that is a really complicated way of doing something that seems very easy. Phew.